life is something to me. I've never ever believed in my life to date her and bring her and go from the hospital with my seat. What a day, 24th of February, 2020, 2024. Things happen. Here I'm going to ask it all Amazing. Amazing. With him, been admitted. Life is so very amazing. You know, when you're planning your own, you don't know what next or kind of um, take over. And that's why the saying that said, um, the only thing that you know about is this present minute like this present meaning that i'm making this video that's the only thing we humans can really say we know about you don't really know about the next minute what will happen the next minute You know, I kind of woke up this morning, started preparing to go to the office. And then, you know, my little baby was running temperature. And I thought it's just to kind of come bring him to the hospital to take injection and that will be to go back home. But here we are, being admitted in the hospital. I'm with him now in the hall. You know, in the ward, in the hospital, and I've been thinking he's sleeping, stressing. But um, I was just sitting down, thinking, just reminiscing of our life. Life is so very amazing. You know, I remember when I was getting married, and then um, you know, so excited that I'm getting married, and then you know. The wedding ceremony and the preparation, you know, it was like kind of sorry, baby. sorry, baby, sorry, don't lie on this thing. You know, so I was saying, I remember the wedding celebration and everything. I was so very excited that you know, I'm getting married Ooh, and all that. I never knew what I was coming into. I never knew, you know, the celebration and all that. How I wish somebody could like kind of say, you're getting married, this is what is going to happen, you know, that's, nobody tells us like that. You know, you just see the glamour of the wedding day. But there's a whole lot of things that comes after the wedding that you just have to kind of um, know about and be ready for. And not just that, especially when the children come, start coming in guys it's not easy to be a, a wife and then <laughs> it's, it's triple not easy to be a, a mother it's really kind of so very challenging and it's something that somebody had to be prepared for for example this present minute now imagine me going to the leaving the house not even thinking that I'm going to end up in the hospital, but now I'm sleeping in the hospital, as in right from the office. My bag is here. Let me show you a bag that I see there. My laptop bag, everything straight from the office, straight to the hospital. And it has been like this. I've been have to watch over him. I'll be able to go home with the twins. And I had to stay over in the hospital with him. 
So why am I making this video? It's for us to know that marriage is something that you have to kind of be ready for. And having children is really something that you have to be triple, 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 triple ready for. Because the challenges, eh? Not be today, oh. Hmm. Not be today. You know. It's something that you're supposed to be as in your life is 247 on duty. No off day. If you just get married and start having children, you are 24 on a duty. Seriously, guys. So, how I wish, you know, before you get married, I know I was saying something last time to myself. I don't, that's the way I feel right now. I'm just telling you guys how I feel right now. And how I feel right now is that how I wish I know this I could have just live my life as a single girl without getting married and having children because boy your life is just not here. It's just not on your own. Anyway, I'm in it now. I just have to kind of find a way to you know solve all solve all this and then get along with it oh boy it's so very challenging it's really not a funny thing no wonder paul said if you can and nobody should even say that um is scripture are getting married it's this just doesn't divine getting married there's just nothing divine there it's just a choice that you have to make that if you really want to do it do it you make that choice to go into it so nobody just has to say that if you're not married you're not doing the right thing or if you're married you're doing the right thing. there's nothing divine then it's a choice that you have to kind of make and be ready for it because it's not today the joining is really not today you can like i'm talking as a woman now I know when how when I was kind of a single girl, not yet married, I know how active I am in my activities, my spiritual activities, as in my church activities. Well, all that is cut off, guys. I just had to kind of um, create a personal, intimate relationship with God to get personally. But church activities, the way I used to do it before, can't do it like that again. And as I was saying, no wonder Paul say, said in the Bible that if you can, stay single. And Jesus Christ too did not even get married. If you look at it critically, he didn't. Because it's really, 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 really not today. It comes with a whole lot of giving up to giving off yourself. Subscribe to this channel, guy. Give me thoughts up and then say something. What do you think about marriage in your own side? How are you? What are your experiences? Is it like kind of rosy rosy? Check away. Just saying, keep the sun very rough. No, it's going to get so long. So just say something. What do you what can you what, what what's the take about um you know? getting married what's your experience like in marriage you know trying to like kind of uh, you get along with your with your partner you know for you people to flow together because you all two of you you came into the marriage with individual mindset you come into it and you try to kind of understand each other and start you know doing this waiting then you know Pregnancy comes in, children comes in, parenting comes in, boy. So I said, it'll be today journey now. There's a whole lot of learning, practicing, on learning. For me, it's a whole lot of learning, practicing, on learning, shielding, sh shading. As in, there are so many things that I have to kind of um, you know, behaviors I had to kind of put a stop to because I'm a wife and I'm a mother. Anyway, right now, as I'm talking to you, I'm in the hospital. I'm watching over my son. 
life's challenges, right? So February, February so far has been a challenging month for me as of now, as in right now, as I'm figuring. It's really a challenging month. But as, you, as usual, I find God that my son is, you know, you know this channel is all about being grateful, right? No matter what you face, you still give thanks, right? So I'm grateful that he's responding to treatment. His temperature is now relaxed. You know, they have to kind of give him a lot of drips. You understand? And then I think they start something on his butt to kind of um, bring down the temperature, which he's responding to. I'm grateful for that. And I'm thankful for life. Yes. You know, as they say, when there's life, there's hope. So, thank you very much for watching this video. Subscribe to this channel. And as usual, I love you. You watching this video, I love you so much. And if there's somebody telling you that I love you, that's good. But I'm still here telling you that I love you. And I'm making this video for you to know that no matter what you face, it's not time for you to give up because you can still find something to be grateful for. Because right now, I'm facing a whole lot of challenges. I just came back from Kaduna and I came to work, 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 and I'm still working and now facing health issue with my children. And even me, I'm not really kind of feeling too well. But my own now is not even an issue right now because I cannot even say about my own stuff, feeling tired or not even getting myself because I have to attend to my children first. So life is full of challenges, but despite the challenge, you still have to find a way to be grateful for what you have. Yes. Yeah, guys, that's about it for this video watch other of my videos i have a whole lot of videos just watch it especially i created a playlist talking about um you know your spiritual life you know challenges of life motherhood and i created a, a playlist again about um just recently about conscious parenting you can also check that out and then you know let's learn about this thing called parenting because obviously we cannot parent our children this modern children the way our parents our own parent parent us because a whole lot of things have changed so we have to learn a new way of parenting our own parents so take your time and work that playlist i think i target conscious parenting you will learn a whole lot because i'm learning a whole lot from Dr. Shefali, you know, her, you know, her ways of um, what she's talking about, about parenting. You know, she said something very remarkable that really resonate, uh, you know, that really resonate with me. She said, um, um, conscious parenting is all about parenting yourself. You have to parent yourself fix. And then she said also that you don't need to kind of see your child as your trophy, you know, as if you've won a medal by having children. That they are here with their own mandate, just the way you two you're here with your own mandate. You know, there are a whole lot of things that you learn from that playlist. So take your time and watch, you know, that playlist, Conscious Parenting. You learn a whole lot about it, especially if you're a new mother so that you will not put all your expectation on your child thinking that um your child is your trophy they are here with their own mandate just like you are here with your own mandate what you and i are supposed to do with our children children is what <coughs> to find a um, connection with them as in bond with them and let them be to live their mandate as we nurture them to become what God wants them to be. All right, guys, I don't intend this video to be so long, so I'm going to put a stop to it now. Thank you very much for watching this video. Bye.